be unboxing this new battery I got for my N4110 Dell Inspiron laptop over there. The stock battery like started to go bad. It'll probably hold a 20 minute charge now. So decided it's time to upgrade. The stock one I think on my computer is 4400 milliamp hours. This one is 7400 and it was $43 on Amazon. Two day shipping. Today is Sunday. Uh, yeah, United States Postal Service delivered it on Sunday, so let's get into it. Bubble wrap on bubbles. And here is the actual battery. So it's made by Anchor, or whatever that symbol is, I'm assuming it's an A, professional laptop battery. Extended warranty, direct customer support, money back guarantee, high quality, affordable prices. So, let's read the back here. Grade A cells, this is a 9 cell battery. Safe and durable, fast charge, no memory effect. So the reason this one is more than other ones on Amazon is because it's a 9 cell battery and it actually pokes out, protrudes from the back of the computer more because it holds a longer charge. So it kind of acts as a stand too for helping with the computer breathing. So that wasn't a problem for me. So here it is, you have some foam. The battery, which we're gonna test in the computer actually. Not happy, instruction manual. Don't think I'll need this, but I say that with a lot of things, so hopefully not. So we'll take a look at the battery, then we will pop it in the computer. Okay, silicone gel. Rechargeable lithium ion battery, 7800 milliamp hours. So I was a little off. Um, that's probably just me though. And you can see when it goes in, this will pop out from the bottom of the computer. So I'm going to bring the computer over here now and we are going to take out the current one and pop in this one. Okay, we have our laptop here. We're going to unplug it, it doesn't matter. Let's flip it upside down. Pop out, mine are a little messed up so I just gotta do, this one doesn't really work. Battery, so here is the stock one. Dell. Um, 48 watt hours is all it tells you. It doesn't tell you the actual milliamp hour. But you can probably figure it from the information given. So, here is the new one. It has two little pads on it too, which is good, so it doesn't actually hit the battery. So, we will slide it in. Clips in place, and this one I gotta do it myself. And it is locked in. So, let's see what it looks like raised like this look at it from the side here Get down a little bit and you can see it actually raises the computer up off the ground about about an inch plus or minus so let's go ahead and turn it on see if it works it's turning on see what pops up if anything different pops up Otherwise, we'll assume it worked. Start Windows normally. Right, and here we are on the computer. As you can see, I have 99% battery, and it says I have 7 hours and 10 minutes left um, on my computer before the battery dies. It was up to 100%, but it doesn't stay there very long at all, so um, it'll probably drop down to 95% in the next 5 or 10 minutes or so then it'll start to go down slower so 100% isn't really that accurate with this but um, it's good enough compared to the 20 minutes on my other battery so you can see it still says I have 7 hours and 10 minutes left on the battery I expect more along the lines of 4 hours but it says that um, and it says that even though I'm running at 50 about 30 to 40 percent CPU usage because of this curl right now I don't know if it took that into account yet but it's a very heavy duty program um, in terms of taking up um, CPU um, 
but you can see here okay there we go it adjusted to the CPU usage down to about four hours and seven minutes which is more reasonable um, but you can probably expect closer to five hours around normal usage if you're watching videos probably three or I, I can't tell you for sure but it's a lot better than the stock battery that was 20 minutes so I am satisfied with it um, yeah it's already down to 98 percent now but um, seems like it's gonna last a lot longer than my other battery and if I have any problems I got on Amazon and the company seems pretty good I can and it had that sheet of paper in there too that said if you're not happy they will send you a refund or um, a replacement so everything seems good and so far I am satisfied with this battery that is all I got for you guys and thanks for watching